It had been another long night. Hell, who am I kidding? It had been another long goddamn week. In this case, I brought a drink. It was all too much or too little. I just couldn't tell anymore. Needed to get my head straight, Dr. Dr. Backstock. Dr. Backstock. Yes, go on. I can't sleep. I can't sleep since he left. My husband has gone, and I just need something to help me sleep. Relationships are puerile and vegetative. I'm sure you'll get over him as enough time passes and maybe take up running. It doesn't make any sense. We were fine. He was there and then he was gone. So, would you say there's more than meets the eye to this, should we say, caper? What do you mean? Do you suspect foul play? Foul play? Hmm. A man leads a relatively happy life as a husband, and then one day he just disappears into thin air. Can I tempt you with pink lemonade? Maybe something stronger? Interesting. I could go for a kombucha myself. Miss Alona, this sounds like something I'm gonna have to look into. I'm not the push you up against the wall and give me a name type of private eye. My sleuthings are somewhat more tantric. I brew it myself. It's the vinegary quality that's making it dance. Scent can be a powerful weapon. Did he say anything before he left? No. No clues, no leads? Nothing. Do you happen to carry a photograph of him? Uh, yes. His name's Craig Cassie. He looks so happy. Can I have the sleeping pills, please? I'm prescribing truth. Um, wait, one thing. The last night before he left, he kept tossing and turning in his sleep, repeating. I think it was something like the bold man has the answers. Well, I'm hardly bald, but I assure you, I'll do everything I can to find them. What? The answers.
Um, so soft noodles with avocado, chips, light chi rubicon. Ten thanks. And ten thanks to you too. What's the name of the Chinese? Um, are you alright? Just keeping my ears to the street blade. I'm just trying to catch a break in this crazy town. Hmm. You certainly get around on that thing. I'll bet you know what time the mayor gets a haircut, the vicar serves tea, and Mrs. Brown feeds the ducks at... At 10.30. This guy ever feed any geese in the park? No, uh, I know, no. We'll spit it out, Blade. Just delivered some cinnamon vapor to him a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I gotta go. Uh, vape oil. Hey, Johnny. I'm good. Quick question for you. Have you ever heard of something called cinnamon vape oil? It's a substitute for smoking. I got it. You take it easy, Johnny. Sir, have you seen this man? No. Thank you for your time. My name is Buck Tully, calling from the Board of Vaping Standards. Has there been any suspicious activity in or around your establishment within the last few days? Yes, hello. Is this Vape Fear? Hey, is this the Vape Stop? My name is uh, Lance, and I'm a vapor, and I'm looking for my friend. Do you happen to know a man named Greg Kesey? Well, if he swings by, you be sure to give me a call on... Hello? Is this Planet of the Vapes? Yes, hello. Is this vapes and drapes? Suspicious activity, suspicious characters, anything like that? Well, if he swings by, you tell him, this is... Don Kesey. I'm uh, looking for my son, Greg. Well, you tell him his papa's looking for him, okay? okay. Thank you. And when was the last time you saw him? Never. Okay. I'm looking for a... Hello? Hello? I would ask how and why you're in my office, Mr. Cable. Yeah. But as it stands, I have no time for your nonsensical caterwauling. Me neither. And I must say, great coat. Thank you. Did you write this? Now, if I remember correctly, you discharged yourself from my practice over six months ago. Yeah. I, you, I did when you cleaned my brain. Dr. Backstock's office. No, Who's I'm... this? I'm sorry, we're... We're closed for the foreseeable future. Do you want me to take it? Ma'am, ma I, I understand your distress, but I'm... What a guy. I will call you when we reopen. I was thinking about the, the small guy. Can I use this? 
Mr. Cable, did you see a sign on my door that read, closed? No. It said, sir, what? You doing some, some hobbies? What have you been doing? I tell you, you're a real pillar of this community. You are back Mr. to Cable, that is complicated. Makes me proud and we need people like you. Dr. Backstock's office is closed. This town's not the same as it used to be. Of course, me and you remember the old days, don't we, old Tammy? I used to have a dog uh, that I just let free and every, all everyone else fed it. I never fed it a thing. But one day it was gone. Mr. Cable, if you don't have anything to contribute towards my case, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave my office. Greg Kessie, missing. Vapes. Backstock. You're not getting mixed up with those boys, are you? What do you mean? They're into some shady business, Backstock. Like what? Well, you didn't hear it from me, but, uh, for your own safety, I would uh, go poking my nose into the business of the Tamworth vape scene. They're not like you and I. No rules. I should, uh, I should go. I probably said enough. You stay safe out there. Great, great business, great business. Stay frosty. Dr. Backstock. I'm sorry, but we're closed indefinitely. My apologies. I knew something was wrong. We have your husband, Greg, drop 599 pounds in the phone box behind Tamworth County Council tomorrow at 6 p.m. No police. We will kill him. Have you got that kind of money? Well, me and Greg have been saving for Carolyn. We're on the tight budget, but... I have enough. Was your husband big on the Tamworth vape scene? Well, he does like vaping. He and his friends are quite passionate about it. I don't understand why this matters. What should I do? I'll be in touch. I've been on my mind quite a lot recently. Mm -hmm. uh, that money you owed me. Pray, Pray sensei. sensei. Uh, weird. Um, mm. I definitely, I definitely paid it to you last week. You definitely paid it to me, yeah. Pray, Pray sensei. Really sensei. Because uh, yeah. yeah, actually, only about three and a half minutes ago, I checked my bank and it, it wasn't there. Have you checked it since? Pray Pray sensei. Sensei. Yeah. Well, that's actually a fair point. But Pray yeah, sensei. sensei, I will do that. To the sense today for that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Weird. Hey. You boys, vapors, yeah. Depends who's asking. Yeah, depends who's asking. Pray sensei. Pray sensei. I need to ask you gentlemen a few questions. Mm -hmm. Have you seen this man? Man was 
got a bit fuzzy at the moment. Yeah, his memory's a bit off sometimes. Hey, sensei, sensei. Maybe those things are clouding your judgment. Get this clear mouth out of my face. Get out of his mouth. It's pray sensei. Pray sensei. Pray sensei. Pray sensei. Pray sensei. This man has been kidnapped. I might know something. Pray sensei. Pray sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Mm, a couple of the boys have gone missing recently. Fat Dave. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, sensei. Mm. Sanjay. Mm. Will Thomas is gone. He just disappeared. Couple of class A cloud puffers, those boys. Mm. Pray, sensei. Pray, sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Any ideas why? Pray, Sensei. Pray, Sensei. Pray, sensei. No. No, but they've gone and got the self kidnapped. Oh, uh, word on the street is that uh, their girlfriend's gone. Up, the chica's gone a bit loco. Pray, sensei. I'm sure they're scared to death. You gentlemen, stay safe. Pray, sensei. Yeah. I just thought, um, you actually owe me money. Sorry, pal. It's no problem. Excuse me, do you know the way to vapes and drips? You vape? Good evening. This is Dr. Lance Backstock. Yes, well, a lot of people are trying to book appointments, but my practice is currently closed. Well, I sympathize, ma'am, that you're feeling loco. Couple of that cheek has been lo loco. Man, let me ask you a question. Is your husband or partner missing? Well, I'll be. And let me guess. He vapes. Well, you sit tight, man. Because Backstock's bringing him home. Ah, yes, hello, ma'am. This is Dr. Lance Backstock. I'm returning your call. Can I just ask, is the cause of your distress due to a missing person in your life? He's been kidnapped. Fantastic. Does he still powwow with Will Thomas? What about his other friends? The Python twins. What? No, I'm sorry, I'm not currently taking on any new patients.
So you're telling me that both of the Python twins are missing? This is Dr. Lance Baxter. Did he vape? No. No, that's great. I thank you for your time. 599 pounds. Missing, you say? Ah, yes, hello. I'm looking for my old friend, Wolf Dixon. How is old Wolfie? So, when was the last time that he saw Dimitar? Missing. My name is Dr. Lance Backstock, and I'm returning your call. Well, I haven't seen him for some time. Tell me about it. I'm trying to cut down on the vaping myself. So, who was he last seen with? Darius Costa. Yeah, is, is Darius with you now? No. But he should be at home. Well, maybe I'll call by. We'll get the old band back together. You guys still live out over on... Beautiful spot out there. Yeah, I really like the... Hmm, yeah. Well, I'll talk to you later. Old man has the answers. <sighs> Fishing trip. Fishing trip. <laughs> what do you know about the Tamworth Babe scene? Not much. See him around town. I mean, it's uh, saves on rolling time, I suppose. The designs are nice. You vape? Helps with my uh, anxiety. <coughs> Where are you off to, Mr. Costa? <laughs> I told you. A fish! People's lives are at stake here. <sighs> okay. Okay, Greg. Greg isn't dead. If Greg's not dead, then where is he? <sighs> we know each other from the pub, okay? We go down there, have a chat, swap some vape oils, Share a bag of pork crunch. A couple of weeks ago, he comes to me and says, I've got a consultation, a big consultation coming up. It's gonna solve all my problems. The wife, job, even the way people talk to him. What kind of consultation? He couldn't afford it. I can't afford it.
he kidnapped himself. And, and you... You're all bald. Not for much longer. No. This is... unacceptable. <laughs> this... This isn't a, a curse. It's an opportunity. When Julius Caesar left the theaters of Pompeii, do you think his conspirators focused on his, his scalp? No! Caesar was all-powerful, dangerous, bald. Bald. And Brutus knew it. Jack Chirac, Gandhi, Choka Amuna. We are marked to be bald. We are enough. The fewer men, the greater share of honor. Our Sistine Chapel, the arms of the Venus de Milo. So, it's okay. It's ample, Mr. Coster. Change this town! You could have made the difference! Ah! Didn't take. You all right, mate? What colour are you getting? I'm gonna go ginger, like a fox. My husband has gone. Hey, boy, excuse me, sir. Have you seen this man? 
one day he just disappears. I'm not like you and I. No fools. You're all bold. You really need to start locking your office, Baxter. Mercy. The heat. That'll be the boys in the Turkish bakery downstairs. They know how to crank an oven. Do you know how dangerous it is to strike somebody in the back of the head? Well, you tend to leave yourself uh, touched exposed when you're uh, poking your nose in other people's business. You. Do you vape? Lance, Lance, Lance. Too busy looking at the smoke and not noticing that your feet are on fire. I'm gonna ask you this once, Cable. Where is Greg Kesey? People are worried <coughs> You know full well that I can't break doctor-patient confidentiality, Backstock. But I will tell you this. He left here a new man. Dr. Cable. Mm. You're in over your head, Clark. Have a bit of cow pole, Baxter. Mm. Mm. Okay, suit yourself. <laughs> More for the boys in the brigade! <laughs> Delivery for Mr. Backstock. Should be here very soon. You'll thank me one day for this, Backstock. I'm about to change your life. Delivery? What's going on? He's going to disfigure me, Blade. I don't really have time for this. Just give me the bag, Blade, and then you can go about your day. What is this? Give me the bag! It's the hair of a Grand National winner. Think how powerful you'll feel when I weave that into your head skin. A stallion, bound you across Tamworth Common. Revitalized, conditioned, styled, blow dried, permed, life, Baxter. Life. Inauthentic. We can trade adjectives all you want, Backstock. Blade, pass me my carpeting needle. This is probably illegal. This is anything but above board. I... Yeah, I need to get to Champagne Indian Fusion. So I don't have a certificate on my wall. I'm changing lives, Backstock. 599 quid a pop. Are you going to tell me that's wrong? The money was dirty, Cable. They were extorting their wives. Life savings. Will you not rest until everybody in Tamworth looks like Da Vinci's Vitruvian Man? I was just trying to help these guys. Maybe make a bit of mayonnaise. Get back to the Balkans. And what about Miss Alona? No condiments left in her cupboard. I've been all around this crazy world. I sold carpets in Albania. I did my Duke of Edinburgh in Flyford Fable. Once went to the Gladiator Roadshow, got Shadow's autograph. That guy. But what does it mean? Damn. I guess it's Murphy's Law. All roads lead to Tamworth.
Blade, keep this business to yourself. Can you give me five stars? Yes. Backstock. Do you fancy watching Mel Gibson's Air America on Blu-ray? It's DVD. DVD. No. Do you have any reoccurring dreams? Yes, the lizard could represent your mother. I'm gonna have to call you back. Your hair. Yeah, it's taken pretty well. Yeah. Maybe you could look into it yourself. No. I think I'm going to be okay, Greg. I think I'm going to be okay. <laughs>